Hello, this is Chaos Blue, and welcome back to Mega Man. Last time, we checked out the waterworks a bit after school got cancelled because literally all of the water, in, apparently in the whole damn world, was stolen somehow by I don't know a computer virus or something. Look, just don't don't question it, okay? <laughs> it doesn't need to make sense. What is good because it really doesn't. Okay. Into the waterworks! Like so. What is locked? Hmm. Somewhere we can jack into. Uh. Here? Oh, yeah. Right here. Jack in Mega Man EXE. Uh, what? Wait a second. A custom sprite. Rut row. I see. Well, you're not supposed to be in here, are you? So, go home. You got it. Good. They go home like a good little boy. You know, I don't know what voice. Like, I feel like she calls for like a really high-pitched thing, which I just cannot do. I mean, obviously not. <laughs> Jack in again. Welcome to the waterworks, which seem to be frozen. I mean, water area, ice area, I, I guess I can see the resemblance. Eh, maybe pushing it a little bit. Yeah, let's see what's wrong. So, the gimmick of this area is you slide on ice. That, that's really all there is to it. Although there is a little bit, actually no, that's not entirely fair, there's a little more to it. You can do this as well. Cur drop. Okay, you clearly are an Aqua Tower guy. So, area steel and then double wide sword to do it. And it did, but you didn't drop a Aqua Tower, which was a little bit disappointing. So here's the trick. Here is the trick that will let you solve the, pretty much this whole area. You can go both Horizontal you can go both horizontally and and vertically as well as diagonally. Three whole directions of movement. What a time to be alive, right? <laughs> oh, careful. That'll do it. Or I suppose the six directions, actually, not, not three. Uh, anyway, we need to turn off the faucet so that we can go past. Just, just like, like so. I, hmm. Um, hmm. Well, Wide Sword isn't going to be happening, so... Hmm. Uh, that'll finish off the fish, and that... Well, it won't finish off the Aqua Tower, but it'll do a lot of damage to it. And I just need... There we go. And try arrow, which fires three arrows, each of which does 40 damage, so it hits for 120 damage. Usually 120 anyway. Chances are you're gonna hit, if you hit with one, you're probably gonna hit with all three. Um, let's do that, because it seems, it seems cool. 
And we did it. Try arrow D this time. Hmm. Um, is there anything he No. No, there is not. And another Aqua Tower, okay? Well, it's fine because I have double long sword for you. And we got money. And onward to area t oh hey. Hmm. This cannot possibly end badly. That's no waterworks navy. It must be the triple W. I mean, he didn't immediately attack us, so that does seem to lend some credence to your theory, Lan. You dare call me one of those Triple W lackeys? Why, I oughta... It's Proto Man! You're looking pretty different from your classical rendition, I gotta say. But it's fine. Hmm. Lord Chod. Pretty sure that doesn't stick around in into sequel games. It's kind of a really odd way to address him ac in general, actually. Like, I presumably, presumably, Proto Man addresses Chad here as Chad Sama in Japanese, and they translate it into Lord Chad. But culturally, it just makes no fucking sense at all to have him. Him called that in English. It, it's like a real culture clash moment. Plus, also, he's clearly Sir Skunkhead. Get it right, Proto Man. <laughs> Get in our way, and we'll have to delete you, kid. Again, says the says the third grade Skunkhead, who's clearly the same age as us. I can, and easily at that. I wouldn't even get in trouble for it! Wow, what an asshole. And you see, that's why you shouldn't let let your friends be skunkheads. Because they'll turn into jerks. I don't know if this is a message I should be sending. Uh, whatever. It works like- Hello! If you run water over ice, it'll melt! Seems useful. You can walk over the melted ice, but not over water. Okay. Uh, okay then. Hmm. I- I won- nope. I didn't really think it was possible to cheat there, or at least not practical to cheat there. But I kind of wanted to give it a shot. Um, let's go for the easy double kill here. And we got money. Kind of a pathetically low amount, actually. Turn the handle. It will we'll have melted the ice. Turn it off again. And, uh... Uh, hello. I'm just a friendly neighborhood navvy. It's a dead end from here, sorry. But, and yet I can walk right past you. Hmm. The handle's missing. Hmm. I guess it is, ac is actually a dead end. Well, I'll have to come back here later. Presumably. Ooh, let's use the pot. Well, actually, I should really use these. Ow. Oh, for crying out. Well, that was just a waste of time, really. Right, you're getting Fire Sword. Oh, and I walked straight into that. And then I got hit by that, so you know... That that worked out well for me. Um, uh, 
Oh, yeah, no, that was like just complete a uh, complete miss right there. But now you are the dead. Right, so what is up here anyway? There is another pipe. Okay, water has stopped. Presumably that will be important later on. Hmm. Oh no, this just screams using swords. And dead. Could have been a little bit better, maybe, but whatever. We did it. And the ice is gone. Uh, there was nothing there. Okay. On to the next area! Area 3-ish, I guess. Oh, hey. The pipes are also frozen. Hmm. Right, well, this way went to a item, so I think I'll go this way. Um... Okay, this is gonna be tricky. Of the two of these, the ghost... I mean, it, as long as there's only one of them, I can deal with the other one. It's just dealing with both of them together that will get me killed, most likely. <laughs> Okay, what did I get? I got Cloud O. Short for Oh My, I guess? Sure. Why not? And we got White Sword C. Hmm. Okay, uh. Hmm. This time it's gonna need to be the cloud that I take out first. Um... Do that. Oh, for crying out loud. Oh. Okay, um... Hmm. I can probably hit that guy with a long sword, but not a fire sword. So, let's do this. Ow! Okay, one down. Uh, Fireman will do. Oh, still there, barely. They finished teleporting away, then died. Sort of. Um, right, okay. Um, problem. Oh. No, this is not a problem. This, however. No, no. Also, not a problem. You know, I'm gonna do that, actually. I'd rather dodge bubble a single bubble than dodge an invisible ghost. Um. Although, I would much rather have the chip from the ghost, if I'm being honest. Hmm. I suppose this game predates the star coding for chips. Which is really unfortunate, because I know in future games there is a star coded invis chip. Although, I guess at the same time, invis is not as good in sequel games as it is in this one. Because it's pretty OP in this game. Okay, I got Ice Punch. Knock stuff over. Range one. Wait, no. Uh... Ah! I mean, it seems interesting, at least. Probably better than X Panel. <laughs> okay. Um. Oh, I cannot go down there. 
but I can go this way. Mm. Yeah, we'll do it like this. Ah, double kill! But I didn't get an S rank. What a ripoff. Like, what, what an actual ripoff. Um... So... Let's go Quake. I'm not gonna hit that ghost with either of these chips. That is so annoying. Oh, yeah, I just walked right into the ghost. Um... Double area steal. I don't think I'm going to kill the ghost this turn, though. Hmm. Maybe I should have gone to something different. Yeah, probably should have gone to something different. Well... You're gone now. Be gone, foul demon! Okay, so... Next area! And... I think this is a good place to stop off, actually. Join me next time when we continue exploring the waterworks! Probably to the end of this time. Or this close to it. <laughs> so until then, this has been Let's Play Mega Man! Battle Network! With Chaos Blue. And have a great day. Bye! <laughs>